Hashtag feed your skills. Hashtag let's learn and grow together. Hello everyone. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. A wonderful day to all of you. Welcome to the Institute of Global Professionals. Thank you for joining us to this another live session of free international webinar here in IGP. My lovely audience, I am Marbeth from the Philippines and I am honored to be your host of the day. I'm so glad to be with you once again in this virtual event. I hope that everyone will stay with us until the end of the program because we have a lot of things in store for you today. Here in IGP webinars, your participation and engagement is highly appreciated. In our quiz competition, the top 15 participants will receive the quiz completion certificate that is right after this event. This will be posted in IDP's official Facebook page, then it will be available for you to download. Every day, we also grant certificate of lifetime membership to the most active and consistent participant. So what are you waiting for? Share our live event to your friends and to our community. Write comments and feedback in the comment section. Who knows, you could be the next recipient of IDP's certificate of lifetime membership. And apologies for today because our speaker won't be able to join us for this session due to some personal issue. But rest assured that we will have fun and we will learn a lot through the most exciting part of the program, that is the live quiz competition. For today, so for today, we will just run the live quiz competition and then we will wrap up the session. If you have questions, feel free to send them in the comment section below. I am sure that all of us will have many e-takeaways and pay-ups from this quiz competition. And I am proud to tell you that every day many new participants are joining with us. I would like to welcome all the new participants to IDP's global family. With this, I need to give you a little background about IGP. The Institute of Global Professionals is an educational institution which provides social work. We believe that it is not effective to increase one's skill or skills by just acquiring formal education. So we provide trainings and consultation to generate a proficient generation through webinars, trainings, offline and online courses with best speakers and highly trained coaches from all across the globe so that we, we can cater you with the best learning platform. I'm proud to inform you that IGP is an ISO certified training and education institute. We are internationally recognized and globally accredited. IGP is your trusted platform to learn new things from the global leading leaders. We are the leading online skill development institution with dozens of learners worldwide. Our mission is to empower people and enhance their skills through webinars. Most importantly, IGP is committed to serve. IGP is bringing the community of professionals to grow together and learn from each other. Here in IGP, learning never stops. We wish that you remain with us in this endeavor. Ladies and gentlemen, I am proud to be associated with IGP as a global member. I would like to take this opportunity to welcome all of you to the Institute of Global Professionals Free International Webinar. Once again, I am Marbeth, a core volunteer of IGP from the Philippines. And I am so privileged to, to host today's quiz competition. With this, I'd like to say let's watch together and learn together. We believe that the power is gained by sharing knowledge, not by hoarding it. And we have already successfully 908 webinars in various topics of your interest. All of these are available in our website that is www.eduidp.com. Again, that is www.eduidp.com. Feel free to access them anytime. You may also check all recorded webinars anytime on our Facebook page, Facebook group, and YouTube channel. We expect that all of you are getting a little bit benefited both in your personal and professional development with all of this. And from time to time, you may like, share, tag your friends, and write comments. Share us how IGP is being helpful to you both in your personal and professional development. You may also write feedback that will help us innovate the program. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our Facebook page, Facebook group, and YouTube channel. 
make sure to click the bell button below to be notified with our live streaming every day. Please support us by spreading the news about IDP's free international webinar to your friends and to your community. Your support is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. And before proceeding with our quiz competition, allow me to greet some of our active participants here. Hello to Sir Alex Xavier Alvarez, to Ma'am Evelyn Wapuri, to Marian Pacquiaia, and also we have Dennis Sir, Dennis Sir, Ginto Sarso, one of our CSR team, Isaiah Kiangwi is with us. And we have so many participants in the comment section, and Sir Dennis Sarso is so active helping us in the comment section. So... We have Curly May Resoso, M. Sison, Januar Cindy is with us, P. Ari Cayos Tenorio is with us. Also, also to Wang Di, is it Puntos Wang Di, Jervis Palcotelo, Wang Cook Mangar, Razuzar. Hello to all of you. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. For today, I am presenting to you webinar number 909 on Business Opportunities for Teachers Education Program. Supposedly, we will have Professor Rokan Beranya Pangan from the Philippines, but he was not. we cannot connect with him right now. So, we will just run the quiz competition. The quiz competition is the most awaited part of our webinar. So as one of the innovations that we have here, we run the quiz competition even though the speaker will not be able to join us. This is our way of saying and telling you that we appreciate the time that you spent waiting for this webinar. Thank you so much. And my dear lovely audience, once again, I would like to remind all of you, don't forget to like and subscribe and share our live event. Remember that your attachment encourages us to do better so that we can provide you with our best service. Gear up, because at this moment, we will now proceed to our live quiz competition. I am inviting everyone to go to slido.com and enter the code QUIZIDP. Meanwhile, let's enjoy watching this short video. To join this quiz competition, you have using you have to go to your browser and using your browser, go to www.slido.com and enter the code quiz IDP. And also, I'd like to remind everyone that as you join the quiz competition at slido.com, please register your complete name because the name that you will register will be used in your certificate if you win this quiz competition. And that top. 15 participants will receive the quiz completion certificate 
for this session. I would like to encourage everyone to join our quiz competition. Remember, our code is quiz IGP. So we have already so many participants. We still have a minute to join the quiz competition. Come on, guys. This will be fun. Meanwhile, let me greet Fe Ari Caras, Tenorio, and who else do I have here? Razu Zar, Wangkuk Mongar, Jerbez Falcote Telo, Fe Tenorio again. We have Mufit Kaloshi. Hello. I hope you're enjoying. So go to www.slido.com and enter the code quiz IGP if you want to join our quiz competition. Yes, Faith and Norio, you can join us. Using your browser, please go to slido.com and enter the code quiz IGP. Then you will be able to join us. We have now 34 participants who have joined the quiz competition. Come on, Fit and Aryo, you may join us. Okay, just enter the code quiz IGP. Go to slido.com. Good evening also, Sheila Umpai. We have now 38 users or participants in our quiz. <clears throat> okay, so we have our first question. In order for, for a school to stay in business and be prosperous, prosperous, you must have an attractive facilities or have as a smooth run institution have a smoothly run institution the correct answer is have an attractive facilities is the correct answer only 37 percent of the participants were able to get the correct answer on the leaderboard we have alex javier alvarez Gemma benelada nina generale Gerald Alfarero, and then Gemaline Rivera. Question number two. An effective individual career planning program for a high school includes identifying financial aid or choosing appropriate courses. The correct answer is choosing appropriate courses. 94% of the participants were able to get the correct answer. Well done. On the leaderboard, we have Gemma Benelada, Alex Javier Alvarez, Gerald Alfarero, Tashi Dema, and Jimaline V. Rivera. Question number three. Which course of study prepares the student for the least number of post-secondary opportunities, college tech prep or career prep? The correct answer is career prep. 49% of the participants were able to get the correct answer. We have 
Gerald Alparero, and then Timalin Rivera, Tashi Dema, Kiefer Rivera, and Asokumar Adhikari. Hello, sir, AK. Question number four. It is important for the teacher to identify which facility is to be used for the presentation because it may be the may be the educator's locker room or there may be times when a special room may be necessary. The correct answer is the second option. There may be times when a special room may be necessary. On the leaderboard, Jimalyn Rivera is leading, followed by Tashi Dema, Gerald R. Parero, A.K. Adhikari, and Kiefer Rivera. Next question. Determining resources for program content as directed by state regulatory agencies and more that you can review, not an action to take to develop curriculum or the first action to take to develop the curriculum. Option number two is the correct answer. It is the first action to take to develop the curriculum. 92% of the participants were able to get the correct answer. Okay, we have Jimalyn Rivera on the leaderboard, followed by Tashi Dema, Asakumar Ahli, Kari Kiper Rivera, and Alex Xavier Alvarez. Question number six this time. A school program that allows students to receive academic credit for career work outside school. Is it ASVAB or Cooperative Education? The correct answer is Cooperative Education. 68% of the participants were able to get the correct answer. So we still have Jimalyn Rivera. Next is Asap Kumar, Adhikari, Kifa Rivera, Alex Xavier Alvarez, and Gemma Benelada on our leaderboard. Next question, career and technical education. Prepare students for careers in specific trades or a school inside the home taught by a woman. Everyone answered the first option, and that is the correct answer. So we still have Jimalyn Rivera, A.K. Adhikari, Kiva Rivera, Alex Xavier Alvarez, and Gemma Benelada on our leaderboard. Question number eight. The key to success of any business is brainstorming or teamwork. Ninety-five percent answered teamwork, and that is the correct answer. Good job. Okay, we have Timal Rivera, A.K. Adhikari, Kifa Rivera, Alex Xavier Alvarez, and Gerald Alparero on the leaderboard. Question number nine, a person who starts a business, intern or entrepreneur? The correct answer is Entrepreneur, 87% of the participants were able to get the correct answer. So we have Dimalin Rivera still on the leaderboard, followed by A.K. Adhikari, Kifa Rivera, Alex Xavier Alvarez, and Gerald R. Ferrero. And for our last question, a person with a long mowing business has an outdoor Retail business or work environment?
The correct answer is work environment. 43% of the participants were able to get the correct answer. And congratulations to our top 15 participants. We have Timalin Rivera. Next is Leia Facunla, Ginalin Delulia, Resurrection, Keeper Rivera, Tashi Dema. And who else do we have for our top six? Let me see. Congratulations to our top 15 winners. So I have here. Number six is AK and Hikari. Number seven is Joel. Seventh place is Joel Bernasar. Next is Alex Javier Alvarez. On the eighth place, ninth place is Jeffrey Salem. Tenth place is Villanueva. Eleventh place is Gerald Alfarero. And then twelfth place is Wang Di. Thirteenth place is. De La Cruz, 14th place is Salvicho, and on the 15th place is Capuno. Congratulations to our top 15 participants. You will be receiving your quiz completion certificate in a little while. It will be posted in IGP's official Facebook page. Congratulations to all of you. Thank you so much for joining our quiz competition. To my fellow knowledge seekers, I would like to thank all of you for attending today's session. Let me thank all of you for being so active and participative all throughout the quiz competition. And I am inviting everyone to join our Facebook page, Facebook group, and subscribe our YouTube channel. And if you have questions, please don't hesitate to ask. Keep in mind that IGP cares for you. Hopefully, you have learned something here today that will be useful in your life. The beautiful thing about learning is nobody can take it away from you. That is from Bibi King. And if you have learned something new or we have been helpful to you even just in a little bit, please leave a review on our page. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe our Facebook page, page Facebook group, and YouTube channel. Please spread the information about IGP to your friends. And thank you for joining us. And congratulations to you, say A.K. Adhikari, for being the sixth placer. Well, that concludes our program for today. To all the IGP Live Quiz Competition participants, thank you so much for your unwavering support. Thank you for your active participation. Words are inadequate to thank all of you. Remember that IGP is here to render you our best service. And also, congratulations to Team IGP for another successful live session. That's all for today. We hope to see you all again in our upcoming webinar that is tomorrow morning. All things work together for good to those who love God and to those who are called according to His purpose. Again, this has been your host, Marbeth from the Philippines signing off. Thank you so much. Stay happy and stay safe. To God be the glory. Bye, everyone.